I want to talk about God healing me from asthma. If God can heal me from asthma, God can heal you from asthma. Maybe you have some type of injury or illness. God can heal you from it as well. God is not limited. Anyways, back in 2006, I was in the United States Marine Corps. And one day, I was really having a hard time catching my breath. So I went to the hospital and they told me that I have asthma. And they said that my lungs were between 70 to 80% working or however they said it. So the working capacity, 70 to 80%, I believe. So I was prescribed this inhaler here and I had to take it everywhere. And I wasn't used to taking an inhaler, so many of the time I would forget it at home. <laughs> so I would have asthma attacks and I had to suffer through it until I got home, which was awful. Okay, further down the line, I was prescribed Simbacort. With this, every single day I had to take this when I woke up and when or before I went to bed. So two times a day, two puffs each. Two puffs in the morning, two puffs in the evening. Horrible. And I found out that the more that I took these inhalers, the worse my breathing got to the point where now my breathing was bad, but after taking these things, my breathing got worse. And every year, I would have to go to the emergency room at least four times a year, or three times a year. At least three times a year. Sometimes six times a year. Because my asthma would get so bad where none of these inhalers would work at all it was really horrible like how can i say it it is kind of like suffocating somewhat horrible feeling bad feeling awful so i really got tired of having asthma so i started to learn more and more about god and I found out that God can heal you. So I started to learn what I have to do to be healed. I found out that when you are not obedient to God, curses are going to come to you. So I was thinking to myself, I may have asthma because I am cursed. So not all at once, but more and more and more, I started to follow the rules and regulations of God. More and more and more. And I found that the more obedient I was to him, my asthma seemed to be not as bad. But this was over the course of, let me see, from 2006 to... 2013 or 14 I believe so it took me many years to get right with God <laughs> many years anyways <laughs> my God so around 2013 I saw that my breathing was not as bad but the thing about it, it takes faith and obedience. The doctors in the military told me that I was going to have asthma for the rest of my life. So 2006 to 2014, I believe. So that is about, let's see, six, that'll be 12, 13, 14, eight years. 
So I had eight years of asthma. Or I had asthma for eight years. When the doctor told me that I was going to have it forever. Forever. Obedience and faith. That is it. That's all it takes. So you may have back problems, eye problems, whatever else problem. God can heal you from it. I really hope this makes sense. God bless.